To get started with Tidler Pro in Avid Media Composer, navigate to the Effect Palette and select New Blue Tidler Pro. Drag and drop the Tidler Pro effect onto an empty video track to add it to your timeline. Alternatively, you can right click on an empty track and select Add Slash Edit Title. When prompted with the confirmation box, click OK. Both of these options will create a new title and automatically open Tidler Pro. To make changes to an existing title, select the title in your timeline, navigate to the Effect Editor, and click Launch User Interface. You may first be prompted with the Quick Edit Interface or the Title Designer depending on your version of Tidler Pro. You can switch back and forth between the two interfaces using the Settings dropdown and selecting Go to Title Designer or Go to Quick Edit. The Quick Edit Interface is where you can manage all of the titles in your project. The Project Library lets you navigate all of your available templates which can be previewed by hovering your mouse over a thumbnail. Apply a template to the current title by double-clicking or dragging it to the title of your choosing. The variable controls allow you to change predefined aspects about your title, such as its duration, template, text, or any number of other variables. The preview window above allows you to see your title before caching and comes with the simple playback slider for viewing animated titles. To edit an existing title design, or create your own title from scratch, enter the Title Designer by opening the Settings dropdown and selecting Go to Title Designer, or just click the Title Designer button below the preview window. From inside the Title Designer, you can make changes to every aspect of your title. Above the workspace are text parameters that range from font, size, alignment, kerning, and letting. There are also options for changing how your text appears within its bounding box, as well as displaying grids, rulers, and safe margins, which can be customized from inside the view dropdown. These features and many more can be accessed using hotkeys. To see all of the hotkeys for Tidler Pro, click on Help and select Shortcuts. This will open your internet browser to Tidler Pro's help page on Shortcuts. If you'd rather create your text with a preset, you can click the Styles button, which will navigate your library to the Text Styles tab. From here, you can mouse over different templates to see them previewed over your text, and apply a template by double-clicking or dragging it to the desired element within your workspace. The library also contains a variety of other resources, such as paragraph templates, project templates, shapes, and animated transitions. To add an animation to your title, you can double-click, drag it into the workspace, or drag it onto the desired element in the timeline. When dragging to the timeline, drag the animation to the beginning of an object to add it as an intro, or drag it to the end of an object to add it as an outro. Once you've applied an animation to your object, you can modify the attributes of individual animations by clicking on them in the timeline and opening the Transitions tab. To adjust their length, simply drag their handles on the timeline. If you'd rather create a custom animation, open the Object menu under the Attributes tab and check Turn on Keyframing. Now when you make changes to that element, a keyframe will appear on the timeline representing its current attributes. You may also notice yellow and green regions above the timeline. These are indicators for the Elastic Timeline, a feature unique to Tidler Pro which makes changing title durations a snap. When you change a title's length, the orange regions will play in full while cutting or adding time to the green regions. This way, the speed and duration of your animations can remain unchanged regardless of the duration of the title as a whole. Multiple regions can be added by clicking the plus button next to the time indicator, and you can change any region's length by dragging its handle. Finally, you can make changes to aspects of your title, such as camera properties and lighting from inside the Scene tab. You can also turn on keyframing to animate your lights, just as you could with the other elements of your title. When you're done working in the Title Designer, you will have the option of saving your changes to a template or keeping them just for this project. Once you've closed out of the Tidler Pro interface, your new title will be all set and ready to go on your timeline.